All right. Aqua Spa. Spa Aqua. Something like that. Something like this. Got a salon in there for nails, hair, and everything. And uh, women's locker room goes through there, and then the men's comes in through here, past the fitness center. They got stair, stair mill, treadmills, coming down here. Kind of dark in here. So, recumbent bicycles, ellipticals, treadmills, and uh, more stuff up there. Got shoulder press right here. What are we at? Cybex. Cybex side lateral, Cybex shoulders. <sighs> Smith machine. Pull down, lap pull down. A couple of dumbbells. It's pretty sad if you're serious. And one either rear delt or back machine. Uh, yeah. Ab, ab stations, lower back. Legs, that's a calf machine right there. Seated calf. I guess I'll come over here. Maybe it'd be better with the light like this. All right, so we got a leg extension, seated calf machine, tricep machine right there. Everything really basic. Leg extension. I guess that was the leg curl. There's your leg curl, leg extension, leg press. Coming over here, hip abductors and uh, bicep preacher curl machine. Oh, here's some more dumbbells. Got your uh, Gravitron pull-up bar dip station. Dumbbells up to 50. Not sure what you can do with those, not very heavy. And then here's your multi-station cable crossovers, things like that. That's a look at the gym area. Personally, I think I'll go to LVC or EOS because unless I'm doing cardio, this isn't gonna cut it for me, but it's still functional. I, the gym at the uh, Red Rock Resort, pretty much better. However, out here you have this multi-room and they do classes in here, all kinds of core class, core strength. And out there, where I'm going to go show you to do a separate video, is the most incredible hydro pool I've ever seen, but I'll do that on a separate video. All right, that's it. It's a look at the gym here at the JW Marriott in Las Vegas. You see, tilt up, there's, I don't know what's up there, offices or something. It's, it's cool, and it's good, you know, for your cardio and your basic strength. Leaves a lot to be desired for an advanced lifter. It's Vic Newman signing out.